Breaking news, Game Maker just became free for non-commercial use. This is major news for me. I've always admired Game Maker from a distance and it looked like a great engine, but I was previously deterred from it by the old subscription pricing model. But just today, Game Maker not only announced that they're making the engine free for non-commercial use, but they're also charging a one-time fee of $99 for the commercial license. A one-time fee! Big W, Game Maker. Big W. Also, for the Enterprise subscription, it's like $80 a month. I mean, I don't know if that changed. I think that was always that way. But it's just amazing to see. And here's some frequently asked questions. How much does it cost to use GameMaker? It's absolutely free to download and keep for non-commercial use. For commercial use, use the other licenses, which are specified here. And the free limitations of GameMaker are basically it. If you want to make money for your game, you need a commercial license. And if you want to export to console, you need the Enterprise subscription. Other than that, everything else is free and unlimited. And I love this because it's so clear what they want to do. Like, and I love how they address the watermark question. Does GameMaker have a watermark? Nope. Whether you're on a free tier or on two pay tiers, GameMaker does not force a watermark or splash screens. That's like just a straight defiance to Unity. I, I, I love this. It's so clear. It's so clear what they're providing here. It's not a bunch of confusing runtime stuff that we have to jump around and do some circus act stuff. It's just so clear what they are trying to do and what they want to do. And what happens if I bought an old version? So they specify all this stuff. You can check it out. The link to this is in the description. So yeah, I am definitely picking up Game Maker. I just finished downloading it actually. I will be learning it over the course of the next few months and it may replace Unity for me. And because of this, I will definitely be learning the engine without a doubt. The engine is over two decades old and they're not new to the ball game. And there have been some amazing games made with it in the past, such as Undertale, Hotline Miami, and the Hyperlight Drifter. With that said, there's a possibility you may be seeing a huge influx of Game Maker content coming soon to this channel. I'm literally so happy about this. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. If you're new to game development and this channel, maybe this video can point you in the right direction. Alright, see ya.